Ladies and gentlemen, we are now live uh, on the People's Populist Press channel. We have uh, Josh, owner of Kiwi Farms. We have Coach Red Pill, and we even have Godwinson, the uh, king of cow, apparently, the leader of the alt-right Illuminati himself. And the reason we're doing this stream is very simple. We forgot to talk about one very special individual today on This Week in Nectar. That man is Andy Worski. And Andy Worski, apparently, I had learned this news just recently. Josh told me. He's actually moved in with Ethan Ralph. Holy fucking shit. Can you imagine the fucking bullshit these faggots are going to get up to together? I mean, you know, like, uh, how many bathrooms are in the house? You know, there's just, there's so many questions that are unanswered. <laughs> is Nora ever going to move in? And if Nora moves in, will Andy have right to her pussy? by right of having been there in the house. There's just so much fucking unanswered questions. And I'd like, you know, everybody here to give kind of their take on Andy moving in with Ethan. Does, is I this going to end well? Are they all going to prison? Or I think, uh, they're, or I think they're going to be joined by a third roommate that's going to take up more space than both of them combined. I think the whale is going to be joining them. Well, wow. you know what the original plan was, right? For a third roommate? Who, no. was, who was the original plan? Josh, guess, let us know. Guess, guess. Don't, don't say it, Coach. I know you know. Guess. Wow. Uh, did you hear that voice crack? Holy fucking shit. Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to guess that the next roommate it would be Zoom. Yes. Really? Yes, yes that was the plan. <clears throat> what? Bullshit. Shit, where do you hear no, that from? That was the plan. Look, see, the chat knew too. The chat, this is the Believe Media today. They knew. Wait, what? Really? So yeah. the plan is for Andy, Ralph, and Zoom all to live together, and nothing's going to go wrong. I can't wait until the stream where Zoom turns on them both and they come downstairs and just fucking kill them with baseball bats. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah man you know. that's the reason zoom won't live with them can you imagine holy shit zoom's called me a pedophile god damn it gator give me the ball back gator <laughs> give me the ball back gator break his kneecaps gator is, is gator gonna have like a literal physical soundboard that they they club people to death with is that how they they put them down holy fuck can you just imagine, though, like the fucking discussions and it, every fucking day, you know, it would just be incredible. I'd love to be a fly on the wall in that house. They're, they're the cowboys. They, they're fucking, I'm having a breakdown, Ethan. I'm having a breakdown, Ethan. Oh, no. I'm having a and panic Ethan, attack. Just, I'm having a panic attack. <laughs> you know, yeah, man, I'm having a panic attack. You know, now that you mention it, there are going to be personal, you know, in-person discussions about about cow. That, that's unavoidable. It's going to happen. They're going to have to talk about the cyclical together in the house, probably while drinking. Wow. Can you imagine three in real life human beings and they're just sitting around in real life talking about how the cowboards influence them and how they can't handle the cowboards? Can you fuck? I can just. It blows my fucking mind. Who thought this would be a good idea? They all just, nobody told them it would be a bad idea for all of them to move in together? What, Does anyone know why? Uh, they are going to, they, they crowdfunded $4,000 from their fans to support a trip to Miami together to do in real live streaming. And uh, I think that, prom I, I, what I was told was that Andy Worski was going to be moving nearby in Virginia. I didn't know they would be living together. Okay. Here's what I think we should we should push for in our organized Illuminati ops. We should push for Zoom to move in and then for them to set up like big brother cameras so that 24 seven <laughs> you can watch the house adventures of Ralph Worski and Zoom as they just get up to wacky misadventures. <laughs> I think it would be phenomenal. I would pay pig for that. I don't know. <laughs> Did I, you watch it? I'd pay pig for that too. Yeah, I, I would. That would be fucking incredible. <laughs> the Big Brother house of fucking. Yeah, if you tossed in pine cone, it would be oh better than Pornhub probably. <laughs> oh, there would be uh, there would be autistic people who would jerk off to it. You know, that would be their porn. Yeah. Who, would, who would get arrested first? <laughs> Worski. Worski? Ooh, I think I it's Worski. Now, well, Ethan, well, no, Ethan no, might have... No, Worski would get in trouble first, but the first arrest would be uh, Ralph because he's got a record. And, and mm -hmm. so the cops would automatically light on him and just make his life miserable. Yeah, that, that, that's... Any, anybody else got to take on that? I, I can't imagine, though, how Andy even got, like, a visa, like, to come to the States. Like, how is he doing this? You, like, you can you can travel to America for ninety days without a visa. Uh, I don't know what the fuck they're gonna do after that. Well, it's obviously gonna last ninety days. 
This is going to last, what, a week at most before they both Trump needs to tighten this shit up. Trump needs to fucking figure it out and deny Worski entry before it's too late. This is this is the plan from when I was in the itinerary of these assholes. They're, they're supposed to go to um, D.C. in a couple of days, right? They're in, in Richmond now. They're going to go to D.C. in a couple of days. And by next Monday, they're going to be in Miami. Um I'm willing to put down 10 bucks, 10 bucks that they don't make it to Miami by next Monday. So that something happened. Are, are you that, saying that they don't make it to Miami at all? Or, you, or that's, um, that's are you betting on an overdose PPP? Or? <laughs> wow. I, I'm going to bet that they do make it to Miami, but I'm going to bet that in Miami, that's where it all comes to an end. Miami is where they're going to get arrested. Now, well, maybe it'll me, be in DC. I'm, I'm, from, I'm from Florida. Do not, do not DUI in Florida. They, they are out for the, the highway patrol in Florida is, is fucking vampire. They will. They have the most well-funded. I would argue they probably have the most well-funded highway patrol in the entire country. And if they get caught with like drugs, there, there's a zero tolerance policy in Florida. It, it would completely fuck their lives up if they they bring drugs into Florida. I think the DC police are used to fucking weirdos. Uh, and so Ethan, Ralph and Worski may not hit their radar, but as soon as they head like into Florida and, the, and Miami and they're trying to fuck around like this, they don't like it. Cause it's not good for tourists to see a drunken Southern redneck and a coked up Canadian <laughs> fucking bumbling around the street, threatening to fight people. And, um, <laughs> you know, you know something, you know, three P you convinced me, you know, I withdraw my bet because I think you're right. I think my, Miami is going to be their Waterloo. Oh, God. It damn. is. Miami is the Waterloo. As soon as you hear Ralph Worski in Miami, you go, oh, <laughs> the fuck no. How, how much Coke is, is Ethan, uh, is, sorry, is Andy going to get into in Miami? Uh, God only knows. And I hope they bust him and I hope they don't send him back to Canada because he would be a huge burden to our taxpayer system that's already overburdened. I hope that the American correctional system teaches Andy the way. You know? That would be the best possible ending. Where is Geek Thulu in all this? Is he going to be moving in as well? Is he going to be moving in the garden or something in the shed? No, he, he's the abused wife. He's just going to be left behind while the boys have their fun. Yeah, well, Gator is going to definitely have his own cut shed in the backyard. <laughs> <laughs> but is Zidane going to hang out in the cut shed with Gator? Oh, or is- no, 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 no. Zidane's, Zidane's gone. I'm going to, I'm going to, oh, here, I will make a bet. I'll make again. I don't hate Ralph, but I will make a bet that Zidane is never coming back. Would anybody take that bet? I think nope. Zidane. Yeah, he's completely. He's put on his coat and he's gone for a walk down the shops. So he's never coming back. Yeah, he went to get a pack of cigarettes. Yeah. No. So everybody's in agreement. Nobody's going to take my bet. Zidane is nope. gone. Chat. Well, any of you fuckers going to take my bet? Right? Zidane would come back for a one-off or a special. Nope. But, Not even. I, no. I think that he. he he lost all his um, – he, he just thinks that – Zidane is not a stupid guy. I think that he recognized that he he would he was always going to be like the sidekick. He had his post-show, and he had no problem with that. But then I think that the behavior of Ralph over the last couple of weeks is just like, fuck this guy. I think I think that he is a young adult and a young professional, and there are, there have been certain things that have happened that have warned him that uh, he would have to dedicate himself fully to this, and he's mm-hmm. seen that that does not yield success. Yeah, like like exactly. demonstrably, exactly. repeatedly uh, it, trying to make your living doing streaming and shit is, is just like even if it happens and and you got the gravy train and it's going good, it it. it, it ends abruptly and it's hard to plan for because it's not yeah, like a, well, a it doesn't thing. end abruptly it ends whenever you decide to do a crossover meetup in real life is when it decides to end <laughs> it seems. uh every well, single time people are, people are saying in chat that you're jealous of <clears throat> ralph meeting up and doing miami me am i jealous of it no 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 coaches coaches jealous apparently according to people in chat no no i'm not at all but I mean, people can say whatever they want. No, I'm not jealous at all. I mean, I lived in Miami. Okay. I mean, this could be you now. You could be moving in. You could be Zoom. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, on, oh my God. Can you imagine? It's Coach, Zoom, Worski, and Ralph all in the same house. How do they get along? Oh, no, I- no, no. Be- because you got to keep in mind, see, for me, Nashville was fun. But it was, it was what? Uh, two, three nights, right? And uh, yeah, you have a blast. You pretend like you're back in college, right? But you know, I mean, shit, you know, just for a long weekend, not for like a week. 
or maybe a week. Okay, maybe. Yeah, it'd be fun. But more than that, fuck off, man. No way. Do you think they'll? Do you think they'll steal your patented idea of a skydive? Oh, if they do, they can do it. I mean, I mean, it's not an idea. It's just a trivial thing. But what this needs to be, I've just realized. What this needs to be, okay? They need to move in Gator and Zoom. And they have to do their version of the Jersey Shore house. And they have to find like four whales to go in with them. And they, well, they have one, you know, so they're and set. They rent out a house. I, they, they can steal this idea, okay? I don't want any royalties for this, but I think this is genius. It's a shore house. They have four fucking whales, ham planets they get from <laughs> chat or whatever, yeah. and those four, and they just film it over the course of a summer. Just their crazy antics until somebody goes to jail. Here, wait, wait. I, I have a way to improve wait, wait, wait. We call it whale swap. Well, whale swap. Yeah. You said it was it was what four people it was it was Ralph, uh, Gator, Zoom, and Andy, right? Yeah. yeah. And then four whales. I have a way to improve this easily. You make it three whales. <laughs> now, now there is a an, an issue in the equilibrium, and there is a guaranteed drama. No, one because one man won't get a whale. Exactly. Yeah, They're but, but we all know that's going to be. Come, come on. Who's, it's, it's, that's, who's well? It'd yeah. be Ethan, I guess, would end up without the whale, right? Because he's got a wife, his own whale already. <laughs> you said it, brother. But uh, no, I, I personally don't think that um, one member of that quartet would get laid. Even if they had their own shore house in Miami, coach, mm -hmm. with mountains of cocaine and booze from yep. the pay pigs. Yep. Oh, man, that's tough. That's tough to hear. Godwinson, are, are you down to start a shore house with us four? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> but here's the issue. The you know, you know this, this is the thing about Andy Worski, you know, that puppy, he can't muster the gumption to go, get good looking trim. You know, I mean, he, he was like the big star of Knoxville. And look what he got. You know, that puppy is just, you know, he's all bark, you know, and, and no bite, you know. Oh, it's yaps, yaps, God. yaps, yaps, you know. Like, he's a man. He's a stud. But, you know, he can't deliver. What a fucking well, pussy. Honestly, like, <laughs> he should be able to do better for himself. Like, like, he's reasonably, I guess, okay looking for a man. He's not totally obese or whatever. He seems to have a little bit of charisma, personality to him. He should be not able to get pussy, but, you not know, he has a cool I, I, I think he's scared of girls. Or let me phrase that. I think he's scared of normal-looking girls. That's why he goes and harpoons whales. That's why he's Captain Ahab, harpooning white whales. <laughs> Arr, arr, she blows. Well, supposedly, bird bow. supposedly oh. he and her were, were like on and off again, which is why when uh, he, when he her, disavowed which her, whale, which whale, the pine the cone pine, one, pine cone or the official girlfriend? I think pine cone. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. And well, which made him, you know, like dumping on her, like kind of, kind of sad. Like, what did she do to deserve that? She didn't do nothing. She didn't do nothing. And she he didn't bad mouthed her relentlessly. Just shit on this girl, <laughs> you know, uh, uh, because like when I first alluded to her, I just said that she was an overweight girl with tattoos. That was it. And and you guys can 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 back me up here. That's all I said in my stream about uh, the Knoxville trip, right? And she was the one who like raised her hand. It was like, oh, coach, stop talking about me, 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 and waving her hands like crazy so people would notice. Okay, fine. So she gets noticed and she wants her little attention, her, her 15 minutes of fame, fine. But then Andy goes and shits on her. I mean, he took a giant dump on this girl. It was like worse than that. Uh, remember that, that thing, that uh, two girls in a cup thing of a few years ago? God damn, it was like that, right? Oh, yes. That, that We all remember the epic lamemes from Two Girls, One Cup Coach. That was that was a cultural watershed for me and Godwin's generation. <laughs> I'm sure it was. And so, you know, for me, it was just one more example of the Western decadence, you know. But anyway, um, yeah, he shit on her. Josh, yeah. do you only have sympathy for the whale because you want to feed her? Yeah, yes, yes. Like I see it. I see it in chat. I see the feeder comments in chat. No, it's a uh, you know if you if you hook up with a girl, and, you know, <laughs> people are bullying you for it. Like you know, it was your mistake. You don't got to take it out on her. She ain't done nothing. Yeah, it's a th that's the yeah, thing. You know, you know why he he shit on her? I, I can answer that question. I know because see, when everybody realized that he was uh, that he boffed her, um, we made fun of her of him. You know, we just mocked him because she was overweight, okay? The way guys do, you know, guys rib one another. And uh, we ribbed him about it. And he got 
angry and ashamed. And that's kind of sad to, to realize that the guy would uh, shit on the girl who uh, was nice enough to fuck him, just shit on her that publicly, you know, because he was embarrassed. That Doesn't he know there's so many incels out there who would love to fuck Pinecone and the Whale? Doesn't he know? Doesn't he know that Coach's audience desperately would crave to fuck the Whale? And, <laughs> You know, it's like it's like when you see like starving Ethiopian children on the TV and you're throwing away food, you know, poor fucking poor coach's audience was just like, no, let me get Sinead. Let me get her. Come on, please, please. Let, let me let me. I ha I have an issue with something you said. OK, I, I took issue to you make talking about the uh, the starving children in Africa. My my parents, my grandmother told me there are children starving in Africa. So finish everything on your plate. And now I'm fat. I, I think I, I protest that statement. People should eat until they're full. And Me too, Josh. Like, you know, I got hoodwinked into becoming fat. It wasn't my own free will choice to shove that food in my hole. <laughs> it was the patriarchy. The patriarchy done it. I, yeah. I can't not finish my plate because there's fucking starving Marvin out there and it, it eats at my soul. Yeah. It just it's grandma was fault. Yeah. I bet your grandmother was white. Yeah. That that white woman did it to you. The white she picture. Grew up, she you. grew up, to, bless her soul, she grew up during the Great Depression. So, or, or her, uh, her mother did so they were they were well, always at that skin. time you know you had to eat all your meal or you might start to death <laughs> you to nowadays store your energy to survive the winter yeah. store your energy up son <laughs> well i you know i've just been storing up my energy for the apocalypse you know and after that i won't have to eat for a long time well uh, going back to, to the uh warsky situation see yeah i heard i had heard this thing that warsky was hell bent for leather on moving down to richmond and living with ethan ralph okay when i first heard that this idea i thought it was fucking um, insane. Coach, when did you first hear it was it in a private conversation or i i forget where i when i heard it before or after? It was a private conversation, and I heard it from somebody close to Ralph, who was thought it was the same idea. Hmm? The person, Nora. I don't remember. But what I do remember is that, you know, the idea, when I first heard it, I thought, this is insane. And Did you say that? The thing, Andy Worski <clears throat> was insisting on it and just like grinding about it, okay? Which is kind of strange. Why would you want to up, uh, uh, uproot your entire life? to go move in with a guy in another country, okay? I mean, I, I, I'm not saying the guy is gay. I'm saying it's just bizarre. Why would you do that? Okay, well, it's fun. Like I've I've moved in with a guy in Australia. And, mm -hmm. uh, it was a lot of fun. Like but, if the I bromance mean... is just so strong. The bromance between them is so strong that you know Andy doesn't have any friends, any family that he likes to see. He just wants to be close to the gunt. You know, the nearer he is to the gunt, the more <laughs> glorious it. his life is. <laughs> <laughs> but what about his sister? Does, doesn't he have a good relationship with his sister? Or, or is well, he I don't know. I have a good through? relationship with his sister. I've, co I've Coach, come to her many times. Coach, people in the chat are saying that you're responsible for all those tributes of his sister being posted about. Oh, no, no, no. No, no idea about that. That was no. Uh, I claim full responsibility for the tributes of his sister. Oh, that was you. That was me all along. Oh, don't, really? Don't don't, okay. don't take don't take credit from from tribute, Anna. And you know that man <laughs> that man stopped masturbating to improve his load so that his tributes would be worthy of the face of Andy Worski's sister. <laughs> What a oh, legend. You, I'm, you're, sorry. You're I'm just, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're just sorry. lazily mopping up the fucking credit for him. Coach like Redpill. Coach Redpill. Apologize um, to him. Coach Redpill, let's role play. Um, <laughs> you've got an incel. You've got an incel Anon who's seen those pictures of uh, Andy's sister. Mm -hmm. And he wants in on that action. And he wants some advice on how to attract Andy's sister. How, what what <laughs> pointers would you give him? Oh, that's going to be a tough one. Um, how would you... First of all, what rating would you give Andy's sister out of, out of 10? Um, out of 10? Um, I'd give her a solid 7. Yeah? Yeah, 6 and a half. Seven. 6 and a half. So how do you get the way out way out half, seven. Somewhere around <laughs> there. Yeah. yeah, 6 and a half, 7. Yeah. So how do you get this incel to attract this 7? Um... I don't know. I mean, that, that's, I'd have to just get to know uh, Andy's sister a little bit more. But I, I've heard that she sort of like disavowed Andy. Is that accurate? But Coach, I, I heard told that, that all, like, all women are one woman. You know, your advice yeah, should work exactly. on all of them. Yeah. All women should damage goods. 
What? All women are damaged goods? Mm, I don't know. No, he hasn't said that. He hasn't said that, God. Oh, no, sorry, yeah. He's only said, what, pregnant women are damaged goods, right? No. <laughs> no, God! <laughs> Robinson's <laughs> gone full salvo. I don't have any opinion about Andy's sister, okay? I don't know well, how... You, you just said she was a solid seven, so there's an opinion. What makes her a seven? <laughs> what? What makes her a seven? What makes her a seven? Yeah, is it her face? Uh, well, she's got tattoos, right? That's always a bad sign. How much have so you, you seen... So you deduct the point for the tattoos. How much yeah, of this... Where are the other two deduction point points point coming from? Uh, Coach, how much of Andy's sister have you seen? I don't know. I've glanced pictures of her. I mean, I haven't really paid attention to her. I mean, if we're hand to heart, I haven't paid attention to her. But there's I don't an insult. believe you. you with her advice and no, not really. I mean, she, first of all, she's a civilian, right? And, you know, she, she's okay looking. You know, I, I, I mean, no... Uh, no offense to her. She seems perfectly respectable. You know, I have no insight as to who she is. I've never heard her say anything. Although I did see some, I think it was a Facebook post or something. And I forget what it said, but it seemed fairly reasonable and basically berating Andy for being a retard. And uh, yeah, other than that, I have no opinion about the woman. I mean, You're telling aside, me you haven't jerked off to pictures of her feet and done a cum trip. <laughs> no. telling you that you haven't done people, that? People are saying, Coach, that when you... I, I get coach, sex on coach. the regular, so I don't need to jerk off. I mean, so there's that, okay? Coach, and people are saying, though, that you I wouldn't jerk people, off to Andy Worski's sister. Coach, just to be clear. Coach, people are saying that when you ejaculated over those pictures of Andy Worski's sister, <laughs> you needed more water. You needed to drink more water. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I'm gonna die. oh, that's gonna be the meme from this stream. Okay, it is, Good coach. Go. You're fucked. You're fucked now. I'm you... fucked. I'm fucked. <laughs> you're fucked. It should be a point what? of pride. I mean, you win. You win the golden goint for <laughs> goint. The golden goint for contributor of the year. Yeah, well, speaking of, I mean, you're saying that Andy Worski's sister is a civilian and we can't say too much about her, but the gunt was a civilian caught in the crossfire. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't do anything. It was just hanging out. Yeah. Yeah. The gunt was a conscious entity. You know that, right? Yeah. The, the gunt was just wanted to peek out. The gunt wanted to be in the picture because the gunt was never in the picture. And, and the gun felt, you know, neglected. And so it just peeked out underneath that yellow shirt and oh, yeah. just waved at the camera. Hi. You're saying that I, it's an inanimate object and it doesn't feel feelings. How do you know that? I'm not. It does feel feelings. No, no, no. no. PPP said that. He said it's an, an inanimate object and doesn't feel feelings. How the fuck do you I know didn't, that? I never disrespected the gunt in that way, Josh. That's Better disrespectful. Not to disrespect say, you're gunt. misrepresenting me. The gunt is a conscious entity and it has feelings too. And when we mock the gunt, the gunt feels bad, okay? It, it's not you know, just it's a awful. clump of cells, okay? It's it's a it's a living, breathing creature. And that's Fuck why yeah. Ralph can't lose weight. Otherwise, he would abort the gun, and that would be murder. <laughs> and you can't you can't abort the gun because secretly you the, the retort. You can't abort. Yeah, the gun. The, secretly the gun is the retort, and you can't <laughs> abort it. We're, we're we're doing uncovering here. This is oh, investigative shit. journalism. I realized it. The retort is the gunt. The gunt is the retort. Of course. Shit. Why didn't so I? You that? can't abort it. No. If the gunt does not fit, you must quit. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This is the new defense. Is the gunt defense? No, no, Your Honor. Your Honor, it was the gunt that did it. I swear, it wasn't me, Your Honor, that punched the cop. It was my gunt. It's conscious. It tells me what to do. Do you think he could get off on an insanity plea if he did that? <laughs> After Miami, yeah. that's what he should do. I'm not probably he could probably go for like a defense, like after being exposed to, to all these comments on the internet about his stomach. The defendant genuinely believed that his stomach was a sentient creature. And guys, will him you to stream? Murder. Will you guys stream with me Worski's trial when they get arrested at Miami? <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> yeah, live stream that fucker. Yeah, you can't, public the trial and you, you can't. Yeah, you can't bring a camera to the trial, or you know, but you yeah, can't. You know we need a, uh, uh, you know, when they're in court, you know, uh, I'm quite good at drawing. You know, I could I could sketch all of the scenes where yeah. you know, Worski's yeah. family arrive, especially his sister, then I can have them to <laughs> and then coach them off to all over them. <laughs> guys, will you guys in real life with me take the play and just do it in real life tribute? We'll do a Bukaki <laughs> tribute circle jerk, put it up on Pornhub. <laughs> It will be one of the most viewed and epic videos in the history of IBF. <laughs> well, what we, what we can do is that, you know, we could like Bukaki each, but since we live in four geographically disparate areas, we could like FedEx it to one another. 
right? No, just, like, we, ha- we, ha- we have to do it live in front of the courthouse <laughs> on on the drawing that Godwin's in his mate. Otherwise, it, it's it wouldn't be it wouldn't be it would be invalid. Yeah, mm-hmm. I hope mm-hmm. you guys aren't fucking nervous. Like you have like stage fright with your cock. You know, <laughs> uh, I, I don't know I, which I, of us I, is going to come up short of that. I'm an old is man. Coach you know? is not going to get the erection. He's he's old. <laughs> no, <laughs> the, the, the pressure, the pressure. You know. Well, look, you should buy the Wolski sister tribute picks. Coach just needs to drink more water, then he's back on form. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! This this is why Coach didn't want the stream with me and him on his main channel. This is the sort of shit we were doing. Oh, uh, did he admit to it? Did he admit to coming up pictures of Melanie Wolski? Is that what he did? No, no, I didn't. Guys, oh, I can confirm that Coach admitted to coming on pictures of Andy Worski's sister's feet. <laughs> he is a degenerate foot fag. Guys, you have to take oh, him out. You bastard. Oh, that's funny. Oh man. No, no one will ever believe that. No one will no one believes that coach. Oh, we all oh, know yeah, you're in the you know, you know, it's 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 so asshole uh Ethan Ralph will tweet about it because that's the kind of low life scumbag that he is. He no, is I don't know. To tweet it out because he's a cocksucking faggot scumbag. The best part is he's gonna say he's gonna say PPP sent this as a legitimate source, just like Worski quoted me as a legitimate source at one time. I don't know. Coach is obeying the code of silence. He's you know, he's sticking to the never bad mouth and they, you know, he's not gonna admit to coming on pictures of Melanie Worski and posting them all over the internet. Just because he doesn't want to badmouth that day. He doesn't want to badmouth those tributes. No. Mel- Melanie is a sweetheart, you know? And after I fucked her, you, you know, she she called me daddy, but it was it was a sweet and loving call of daddy. It wasn't like, you know, I, I didn't feel ashamed when she called me daddy as compared to when Ralph's mom called me daddy. <laughs> you know, I didn't feel the same degree of shame. I actually felt a little bit of pride, but not too, too much. I don't know. Somehow I find a way to fuck all of their, you know, significant others. I don't know. PPP gets around. <laughs> it's because your anus is so pink. <laughs> it is. Are... <laughs> Fuck. It's the pinkest. Have you ever seen an anus more pink than mine, Josh? I, I haven't. Have it's like I said. It's a like medical I've, anomaly. I've seen uh, porn stars that bleach their anus and yet do not have the natural glow. The natural glow of PPP's anus. No, there's, there's no way. Even with anal bleach. See, I've never bleached it. It's just naturally that pink and righteous. And uh, that's why, you know, <laughs> all the homosexual community loves PPP. He's very popular in the homosexual community because of those pictures. Whereas normally before I had a very bad reputation in the homosexual community. I think I've rehabilitated. <laughs> How do you get a bad reputation in the homosexual community? Are you HIV plus? Well, that is uh, a legal matter that uh, I leave to my attorney. Right. I don't know. Fuck, boys. Coach, this is this has gone well, off the rails. Well, look, I'll bring it back. Coach, what was going through your head when you were masturbating over pictures of the <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, God. Oh, you're, you're trying to, like, you know, pick the thing that you think will drive Andy Worsey insane, okay? And you're, you're missing the target. So you're, you're trying to do it about his sister. No, all you have to tell Andy to send him off the rails <laughs> is just say that he's a little, good little yapping puppy. That will freak him out. That bothers him because he fears that because he knows in his heart that it's true, that he is a little yapping little puppy, a little retarded, idiotic puppy that doesn't know what the fuck it's doing. Yeah, that's Andy Worski. It's not his sister. He could give a shit about his sister. It's it's that people recognize that he's just a yapping puppy. Yeah. And, and I don't just... know. His sister was certainly my puppy. I had her yelping, yelping, yelping. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I don't no. know. I, I, you know, can we put her on a leash? Like, guys, we need to have the shore house, us four, and Melanie. And every night is just us live streaming us uh, over over Melanie's bed. Uh, would, and would uh, go- turns or all at the same time? I think all at the same time. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I, I, I think we could all be Eskimo brothers with Melanie if we're not already. <laughs> I must I, I must confess my sins. See, at one point, like a week ago, I, 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 
I had a gay op in mind, and I was going to rekindle the friendships of Coach, of Andy, of uh, of Ethan, and I, I was gonna I was gonna mend the the burn bridges. And for a while, I had Coach talking to me, I had Ralph talking to me, Andy reached out to me for the for the first time ever, I think. And I'm like, okay, this is a great start tomorrow. You know, maybe maybe I'll pitch the idea. I'll try to get Coach to soften his position because he he had like illicit demands. I'm like, okay, you're not gonna get that maybe i can soften his position over time right and the next day i wake up and and they like had engaged in some massive like twitter like like war like like oh and you did like the shit stream and stuff and it was just like oh, okay i guess that's all fucked up then that's not <laughs> that's not happening and now i feel bad because i i try to be friendly to everybody and and i'm, I'm talking about jerking off to andy Worsey's sister <laughs> <laughs> josh josh hey. you're a good boy that didn't do nothing and, PPP, you know, PPP. People are sending me images of of you protecting Coach and Coach's honor because apparently Coach fucked Melody Worski. You know, this stream is going to get taken down now. It's going to be taken down. <laughs> no. We're gonna, I guess my live streaming capabilities have lasted all of three days. Uh, <laughs> this you know? is your first stream, right? Yeah, all well, the third stream. I did three streams today. I, I'm just since presenting I photographic evidence to the court. Wow. I don't know. Coach, what do you have to say for yourself? Wait, let me see the images. It's on the uh, Hangouts. It's on the uh, Hangouts, Coach. Uh, it's okay, you're it. a little slow. We get that you're old, you're daughter. No, I don't see it. Where do you have it? Oh, just a second, Coach. Just a moment. Bring it back! Oh, my God. God okay. damn. All right, stare into the abyss, Coach. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Those, I don't recognize those... that angle, that composition. I didn't film that. That must have been you were yeah. you Oh my god. god, I am shocked. Do you claim that that's not you? Do you disavow this image? I disavow vehemently. But the physique's that right, physique? isn't it? The physique's that's, on that's point. Coach is, look at that. Look at how amazing that is. But the, the, the thing can't... that I'm so angry about is that that composition is totally, totally wrong. Well, look, I mean, she seems to be enjoying it, Coach. And so do you. <laughs> look, you seem to be very... <laughs> That was the secret NSA feed of Knoxville. <laughs> Unbeknownst to everyone, M Melanie was in the room and she was giving hand jobs to everyone to <laughs> present. And then Coach wasn't satisfied with a hand job at Knoxville. He decided to go the full nine and just bend that bitch right over. And Andy watched from the corner. And what, from what I've heard, word on the street is he was he was playing with his little Peter. He was while uh, while Coach went to town. The eternal <laughs> Chilean. He he was he was diddling his little Peter. While he watched his sister, oof! With That's a Chilean, awful. with a fifty-year-old Chilean man, 51, with a seventy-year-old Chilean 51, man, fifty-one, with a seventy-two-year-old Chilean, man. <laughs> with a seventy-two-year-old Chilean. I, oh wow! I have a question: Is is it tech, is it cucking if it's your sister? <laughs> Because really, you is shouldn't it, want to fuck your coach, sister. Coach, this needs to be your next video. This Tick is a whole new genre of porn. porn. This is oh sex. man. This is a whole new genre of porn. <laughs> has, has anyone ever seen cuckcess porn? Because I want to jerk to it. Can anyone find it for me? <laughs> no, I, 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 my my brain has never wandered here. <laughs> Come on, we're all degenerates in this stream. All of us avowed members of the uh, the movement. We're, yeah, yeah. Well, people are saying I'm funny. I don't really think that's the fucking case. This is a dead serious stream, folks. Yeah, and we're, we're everything that a, we've discovered a new fetish. Look, yeah. look, PPP. You need to do a Byron Brimstone speech about how coming up. How Coach Redfield coming on tributes of Melanie Worski is wrong. Go ahead, man. I do. I don't the, know if do it, it feels that good. Can, if it feels that good, can it really be wrong? That's the question. Do it while because... shouting and preaching about God. <sighs> Now let me tell you something, Coach Red Pill. Let me tell you something more. You have sinned against the Lord Jesus Christ. You have brought yourself into a world of pain and suffering now. I'm telling you, you have crossed the Lord God Almighty with your tribute of Melanie Worski. Yeah, you jerked yourself to full climax on pictures of Andy's sister Mel. Pictures of her feet, yeah. And it was disgusting and depraved against God now, yeah. If you were coming to pictures of her titties or her ass, Jesus would not not be ashamed of you, but because you were being a foot fag, Jesus is going <laughs> to condemn you to the deepest pits of hell, yeah? Jesus is going to put you in a place where the fire burns hot, 
where the worm never dies, where there's brimstone and eternal punishment, yeah. Your cock is gonna be whipped with a bow whip day and night. Locusts, locusts will come down from the pit of hell, and these hellish locusts, demonic locusts, will sting you directly in your ball sack, and you will bleed blood from your ball sack upon pictures of Mel's feet, yeah. And at that point, yeah, you will feel the glory and the wrath of the Lord Jesus, unless you repent from your ways now. Coach, can I get a hallelujah? Hallelujah! Yeah, brother coach, yeah! <laughs> in, in Jesus' name, amen. In Jesus' yeah. name, Testify. Josh. Testify. Josh, I condemn you to the pit of hell for your website, Kiwi Farms. <laughs> Josh, Josh, how could you do that? I'm already there. Hey. <laughs> don't, don't worry. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Bravo, know. bravo, PPP. Bravo, bravo. Woohoo! Here's how, okay, here's how we're going to fund a new stream.me. We're going to make a new YouTube streaming alternative, and we're going to fund it by making PPP become a televangelist and then use that money and, and funnel it into our project so that we can create drama websites. I think Guys, I think I think this can work. Like a plan. Sounds like a all the income plan I would make work. as a televangelist, remember, is tax free. Exactly. Yeah. It's a trick. Yeah, we, gotta, we gotta take a page from Tonka. Yeah. Yeah. You this know, is, I am a legitimate a, this is good. a legitimate pastor of sorts, although I don't use that title, but I am. <laughs> now usually to entice people to donate money, they usually, you know, send like you know, holy water, like little packets of miracle spring water and shit. Uh I think we should do come tributes to Melanie Worski. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Now I'm gonna ask all you out there in the audience now. I want you to pray over your bills. I want you to pray over your bills. And then I want you to take a picture of Melanie Worski out. And I want you to jerk yourself to climax on the pictures of Worski. Worski's sister Mel. And after the cum touches the paper of the picture of Mel, your debts will be forgiven by a divine transfer from Jesus Christ. Oh yes, Juice. Can I get an amen from my brother Josh? Amen, brother. Hey, yeah. See, Josh, for the first time in his life, unironically ironically is saying hallelujah and amen and i think that this leo pirate would be pleased i think leo would be would be happy um i'm not i'm definitely not giving thanks to the pope so <laughs> i think we're in the clear yes I, I i personally have not molested any children but i've heard that warski does that on his oh time. no i, I disavow <laughs> I disavow. <laughs> we disavow we disavow we've gone too far brothers we've gone, <laughs> we've gone too, too far. far in a few places oh yes we this is like the prequel trilogy it was visionarily brilliant when we first conceived of this stream to shit on Worski, but in execution, we may have gone a, a bit too far in a few places. <laughs> It's, it's stylistically designed to be that way, but we can diminish the effects of it by disavowing. I, I think I think it I think that coaches come tributes are poetry and they rhyme. <laughs> oh, this now, is fucking savage! Now we're getting there. What? What are we talking about? You're, you're not you're, you're not getting these these dang Star Wars references. So he no, just, he's not. Go, coach. Go, do you know what Red Letter Media is, Coach? What? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <No>! <laughs> Uh, what? Oh, oh no. Um, oh, there was something I wanted to talk about. Oh, it's fucking slipped my mind. Okay, forget it. Alzheimer's no, is No, coach, different. we want to know. We want to know what you did with those pictures of Melanie. Let us know. Oh, man, I gave them to you, motherfucker. You said you wanted them all for your collection. Well, I do have quite the collection. I do. Yeah. That whole wall you have just behind your camera, that's why we can't see it when you when you turn on the camera. It's, you know, you have the camera looking at you, but you're looking at the pictures of Melanie. Yeah. Coach, give us a quick uh, shilling for Wilshire Boulevard, please. Oh, yeah. Everybody go check out my Indiegogo for Wilshire Boulevard. And here's something else I want to ask. Um, what's with uh, Ethan Ralph having that that girl, that 14-year-old kid who's got 800,000 subs who apparently are all pedophiles? I mean, what's the story on that girl? Well... So, yeah, so why does he have her on? And, you know, what's the deal there? I feel as though which of us wants to handle this? Who can answer it best? Is it Josh? Yes, it is. But I've already told Coach this this story. He he, he wants to he wants to bring it up for reasons of drama. I'm not sure if I avow. Go on, Josh. Come on. Go on. Josh, Come on. Josh, Come on. Josh, Josh. Josh. You're in the gayest stream of all time. You may as well. All right. So so started streaming when she was 11, and she would say very sexually explicit things. There's no re there's no doubt in my mind that her parents were involved in getting her set up. 
Um, she currently has 800,000 subscribers after three years. I don't know what she talks about, but I know for a fact that like what she was saying way back when was like, like super per perverted and way, way inappropriate for her. Um, uh, Shadman has drawn porn of her, like getting ejaculated on by, by microphones, implying that she's a whore for YouTube. Um, Shadman has actually had her in Discord with a special rank, even though his Discord is obviously 18 plus. Uh, basically, like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't personally want anything to do with Soph. Uh, I, like, if she tried to join the forum, I would immediately ban her because I think that she's a, a victim of multiple people, and uh, wow. I, I, I disavow in the strongest possible terms. Josh, you've really truly stared into the abyss, eh? Well, that... I, I, I I found out about her because of uh because of Shad. When Shad's site went down, I, I at the time we had like a little blog, and I did research into it, and I did research into um things he had drawn of real people because at the time he had drawn Keemstar's daughter sucking Trump's dick. He had drawn <clears throat> Lieutenant Corbis getting ejaculated on by YouTube microphones, and he had drawn the actress Daphne Keene from Logan being raped by Hugh Jackman, and like wow. that that to me should be illegal. I, I think. Uh, I, I draw the line there. I think that Shadman should have should have. And, and also, like, don't forget, Pyrocynical and Keemstar both, you know, endorsed, gave her a shout out, made her more exposed. She's a smart kid and well, red pill. She got her start. Chat. Yeah, she got her that start. You're spinning it so wrong because you just have to watch her videos and realize how smart and red pilled this young child is. It doesn't matter if she's based in red pill. That's fucking great. I, I would love to see her, you know, have conductive debates at high school. I don't think that she should be jerking off pedophiles on YouTube. Wow, I couldn't have said it better myself, Josh. Thank you for defending reality. Oh. Thank to you. answer Coach's question, how does this girl get onto the kill stream? I have no idea. I don't know. <laughs> how the fuck did she? Well, if we remember, as Sargon said, it depends on the child, and here it depends on the <laughs> sub count. So, because she has eight hundred thousand subs and can grow the kill stream, Ralph thought it was a big brained move to bring her on. But I think that that was one of the catalysts for turning people who were fans like me into uh, hate watchers, and soon people who won't even tune in. Sad. Sad. Wait, did, did uh, what you're saying that Soph specifically made you a hate watcher or? No, no. Just for some people, I'm sure it was the catalyst. He, for me, he I, got a lot of shit for that. Yeah. Yeah. I think there's just too much bullshit and drama surrounding him. So it's only a matter of time. Wait, wait, wait. Zoom asked him to. Is that true? What? That's what Chet's saying? That's what somebody named I've Soph, heard that Seth too. Ferguson, if, what? Oh, man. <laughs> okay. Josh, tell me the truth. Is Zoom running 14D chess on Ralph to destroy him? Yes. <laughs> Clearly. Well, yes. Anybody. Look, the, the guy is a fucking pedophile and he is a liar. And if you associate with him, even for like this, this, this feigning protection of yourself, you're retarded. Like the only but way Josh, to deal with this guy is to ignore him. I've heard that you're a pedophile and a liar. Is that just coming from Zoom? Oh, geez. Yeah, where are these rumors coming from? Question where mark. are they coming from? They're, they're, they're written on ED, so they're true, obviously. Very true facts. True facts, dog. Someday I'll get an ED page, you know, and then I'll be proud. You don't have an ED page? Do people just don't update ED anymore? No one gives a shit. No one gives a shit anymore. I'll, I'll write your ED page. Your ED pages. God, written, do it, please, please. And then I can show. I can show my friends and family. Hey, look, guys, I'm on the site with all the other fucking retards. Thank you. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Coach, you must have an ED page, right? No. God, today's tonight's gonna be a very long night. I better got writing. Godwin said, "Are you gonna create ED pages for all of us now?" <laughs> And you I'm get sure an ED an page. One, and uh, you uh, get an ED page. Godwinson's the Oprah of ED. I think I've got an ED page. It's no, integrated into the Jahan's one. Is it in the Jahan's one? I've never seen. I looked for you on ED. I tried oh. to find you. I was like, Palm, Palmer Eldritch, right? You're in the chat. <clears throat> Are you going to be hosting your spiritual king? No, Ralph, bring him on. on. Bring, bring him on. Somebody send him the link. I'd bring Palmer on. I don't care. Oh, he, he's he's gone. He said later, gents. He's um. As soon as we said that, I don't know. In the chat, he said he wasn't hosting it tonight. I did see him say that. Oh, he won't be hosting. Is that is that true? Or that's what he said. 
Have we offered his platform to Ralph, his spiritual king? Supposedly, Zoom is saying that it's routine maintenance, but nobody who works on the site knows what the fuck is happening. And they've closed, like, the, if you go to the, uh, like, the, they took down the uh, the fucking support page. They, they, they deleted the app. I think that the guy who runs it just has deleted everything yeah, from his are, end, and the staff don't. don't even know. It's either that or there's been an FBI raid on the servers. <laughs> They've gone completely scorched earth. They've probably been thinking about it for a while now. And, you know, the CP stuff was just the straw that broke the camel's back. Yeah, I mean, I don't even... If like if the guys that write the software don't even fucking know, like, I I wouldn't... But people are saying that they're rebranding for the Ice Poseidon thing. Because apparently at one point, dev.scuff.com was... Uh, was looked exactly like the the stream.me interface really yes i don't know i'd say it's a monumental day i i hope that the show can go on i wanted to hear ethan's excuses for all the failures in his life tonight i wanted to see how what chat would say well i want to extend the hand of friendship this week in nectar will provide a home for the refugees of uh the ralph retort uh the two refugees are zidane and Gator, they're the only ones that have visa access into this week in Nectar country. You know, the rest can die. In my mind, Zidane is always welcome. Zidane is a hero, and uh, I think he saw the way the wind was blowing and has got the fuck out of Dodge. Gator, I don't know. Yeah, I, I, I'd have Gator in our community, you know, with his soundboard. Yeah, none of us have yeah, a soundboard. With, with his calls, whispering sweet nothings into the Pinecone's ears. <laughs> oh, you're telling on Gator now. I thought you said he was a sweet, sweet man. He's a sweet, sweet man who was like whispering sweet nothings into a pine cone. He, he gives sweet, sweet blowjobs to his <laughs> master, Ethan. So, so Coach, Coach Red Pill, um, Gator wanted a piece of the whale, right? He wanted a piece I don't of the whale. I, I don't know. The, whale the word I'm getting, and I asked uh, Gator directly, and I never got a response, uh, was, uh, you know, was he involved in like gay ops? Was he coaching her on the phone while she was on the stream with me? Word is, word that I've gotten is that he was. And if he wasn't, well, he hasn't told me otherwise, but that's what I've heard so far. You know, this Gator point, in my say, mind is an NPC. Like, <laughs> if, if the universe is a simulation and, we're, you know, Gator is an NPC whose purpose in life was to be created as the perfect slave boy for Ethan Ralph, you know, <laughs> I think that's what he genuinely is. Like, Either God made him that way or the creator of the simulation made him that way. But I can't imagine Gator doing anything else but slurping Ethan Ralph's balls. Can you guys? Well, he did his own his own thing with the Gator time. Gator time. I uh, I, I feel bad for Gator because it must be it must be frustrating for him because he is he is tied to Ralph and if you know if Ralph has problems he has pro problems. Look, we'll have Gator. We'll we'll adopt Gator. There's a home for you here, mate. <laughs> All right. We, I, Gator, I guess I love you. I'll whisper nothings in your ear as I fuck your ass and use it for my own amusement. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know. I'll, I love you, Gator. It's okay. It's okay. I'll let you suck me off, Gator. It's not gay because yeah. I'm the one who's getting my dick sucked, but you'll be gay. That's okay. <laughs> What? <laughs> do you just really hate the soundboard? Where, where are you channeling this contempt from? It's just, it's, 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 it's God's will. God is, is <laughs> impassioning me. Look, you know, coach, the Holy coach Spirit always told cool. PPP not to be a beta and to lead and not follow. So that's that's exactly yeah. the teaching. Yeah, PP is is taking my words to heart. Yeah, the Good deepest idea. lore is the YouTube comment where Buddy said that I was Godwinson's subservient fucking bow tied guy on his nectar plantation. It really got to me, and so PPP is fucking snapped because of that YouTube comment. <laughs> <laughs> He's just what was that YouTube that? Comment? Let me let me find that YouTube comment because it was uh, it was in a category of its own. PPP. You promised him you'd read it on the air, and the poor fucking guy said, "What alter?" timeline was this read on the air and he's still waiting uh, i don't know where to find it i'm sorry what's funny is i remember seeing that comment like because i i had just i had just seen like a couple of your videos and like this guy is like a fucking legit weirdo but how why does like everybody i've talked to knows of him why and he has no subscribers who the fuck is this guy so i made that comment you're the most influential person under a thousand subs and then i saw in one of the videos that that comment chain with ralph i'm like why is ralph Arguing in the comments of this video for this guy that has like like at the time it was like two fifty.
50 subs. It was a, it was a, an extremely small amount of people. And I was just like, what the fuck? Yeah. It was, it was very I confusing. All right. So I, I'll think read that, <clears throat> I think it's that I have the most charisma and strength of will of any single person on YouTube. I think that's I the agree. case. I agree. Well, look, yeah. Robinson's making Nexa with PPP, and it's rather like a slave plantation owner and his black house staff. <laughs> Every night, Adam sits on the porch looking over his cow plantation and is served mint julep by his subservient bow-tied PPP, the squawks and hooting of Worski and Ralph echoing softly over the fields <laughs> as the sun sets. It's Kino. That's it's Kino. Kino. That's verbal Kino. Yeah. Especially when it's, it's read out by Godwinson's beautiful British voice. It's so yeah. sexy. Can we yeah. read the uh, KOP begging for Josh's outlines message, please? No. Come on, my please. friend. Please. Do it. Please, please read it. Godwinson, oh, read it. It's Do like it. it's like eight minutes long if you were to read it. Have you read, okay, have you read look, it and timed it? Give us the spark notes. Give us the spark notes. Give us the juiciest paragraph. It's been yes. like, does he mention the word outlines? No. <laughs> his his thing was like he got really into into the community. He like very aggressively inserted himself into community assets of the uh, of the site, and he didn't fit in. He was kind of awkward, and eventually I, I banned him. I can't even remember why what the initial incident was. I think I think he was just shit, so I banned him. And he l left me multiple comments, like huge emails about how about how I, I was making a mistake and how he was a part of the community, and I, I was just being juvenile for exercising discretion like that and it's just like I, I told him to fuck off and he immediately becomes litigious like he says like he's gonna sue me for it like i can't ban him it, it was very strange and it's been such a long time um, right uh, have you guys seen that worst video responded coach, to this coach, stream? coach wait, 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 wait. What, 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 addressing you uh, masturbating over pictures of his sister. What? What? He's made a video on Twitter and he's addressing you masturbating over oh, pictures. Oh, really? What does it play? It play it. Let me hear it. I don't have. I don't know how to. I don't know how to play this over the stream. Um, um, PPP. If you, I don't know. I don't know if you'd be able to. Or I don't know. But I mean, he's. I, I mean, he's right. He's entirely I right. Didn't. You Andy guys totally right. me over. He kept on insisting that I had. Oh, you, you pulled a zoom on me, you bastards. We did. I'll, Coach, I'll I want to reveal to you that this was all a gay op. The whole day, yeah. and stream me going down, it was all an op right. by PPP. The video is to get you to admit the, to coming on video pictures of one sister. I knew it. I knew that you were setting me up. Oh, what right, should I do? I'm going to play the video. It's 1 minute 36 seconds long. You're going to have to mute your mic so I can play the audio through my... I'm muting it. Phone. Yeah, so muting it. Time. Hang on. All right, just a sec. Can you all hear this? Uh, so I wanted to comment. Can you all hear that? Right. I can hear oh. it. Yeah, it's blessed. Go. Just a second. Yeah, I will screen share. All right. Because you've got to, like, to be fair, you've got to give Worski a say. I mean, he's been wronged by you, coach, because you came all over those pictures of his sister. So, right. Can you see him talking? Uh, what's up, everyone? Uh, so I wanted to comment on Godwin's stream that he had earlier. It's PPP uh, stream. First okay. of all, Coach Red Bill, uh, who's a piece of shit, said that. Oh, sorry. I just wanted to pause. Oh shit! Right, we'll get. We'll have to go back. Can it's you hear? Uh, he sounds like such a fucking retard. Holy I'm shit! Here. I forgot what his oh. voice sounds like. Can you hear Wolski talking when I play the video? Oh yes. Yeah. Don't worry, Godwinson. I wish I couldn't. On Godwinson's stream, he had earlier. It's it's your stream, PPP. It's not Corporate's stream. I'm just a humble well, local. He's, he's not yet self-aware that I'm my own entity. I just belong to Godwinson, kind of like the Gunt belongs to Ralph. I'm kind of like Godwinson's Gunt. He just pulls it out to impress uh, others. First of all, Coach Red Bull uh, is a piece of shit. He's right there, though, Coach, isn't he? <laughs> Said that, that Ralph cheated on his wife with Kirsten. Complete bullshit. What a fucking liar. Kirsten will attest to this. I have to. Why does the story have to go beyond that? <laughs> you know, about what Coach did, uh, he admitted to this, first of all, about having a girlfriend while being married. Um, and what he doesn't admit, which he told all of us, is that she was his wife was pregnant while he got a girlfriend. She did not her. So there's Worski corroborating Ralph's story. Totally How do you respond to her? Totally not true. <laughs> but you, you didn't just tell totally. Ralph. You told, you told all of them. You told all of them. So, so can Dick Masterson be the third party that confirms or denies? Yeah, I guess so. Well, let's ask him. Ah. Yeah. The piece the rest. of shit is not a real man. That's a bitch that he convinced, and he said it in coach laugh. Oh, when he talked about convincing. That was a good impression. I do. I did like that. <laughs> <laughs> you have an abortion. Oh, 
oh, my internet's dying. La- laugh at what did he say? Laugh at what? He's saying that you, I don't know, something about an abortion. I'll, I'll give him the right to give his own take. Coach is a fucking, imagine, that's the skill. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> Where he talked about convincing his girlfriend to have an abortion. So you didn't just, you didn't just tell them that you instructed your girlfriend to have an abortion. You laughed, coach, as you did so. <laughs> no, I, I never said that. I never said that to them. I have never told any girlfriend to have an abortion. Uh, that's bullshit. Okay. All right. I'm going to carry on with the uh, Worski's clip because we've got to give him the right of reply, surely. Sure. Oh, I think he's frozen. Oh, what's going on? Maybe Come my. On. Oh. Does really? Long Land just have really bad internet? God, that's, the skill. that's the skill he's proud of. I convinced her to have an abortion. Ah, yo. Fucking, what a scumbag. Now, who is down for me talking about this? I'm, talking, I'm thinking about doing an extreme on Purple Dragon um, on YouTube soon about this, about all this stuff. And it's like, just some updates. It's talking about coach abortion pill. Everyone, hashtag coach abortion pill. That, that's the new thing. <laughs> uh, he thinks he's fucking all, 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 uh, he's, 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 he's on a high from being a rat and then also being a fucking liar. And I'm gonna piss all over his fucking face right now. Uh, probably in a few hours after I work out. So just let me know who's interested in that. Uh, and I was talking about coach abortion pill. All right, so he's going to piss all over your face in the same way that you ejaculated all over Malinid. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, oh, God. I, I guess Sad. the puppy is very upset. Oh, my goodness. Well, first of all, I just have to say right off the bat, it's a total lie. I never said to them that uh, I had convinced any girlfriend of mine to have an abortion. Okay, never. And that's an absolute lie. Okay. So if Dick Masterson says, if Dick Masterson says you did, how will you respond? I'll say that that's a lie. Okay. okay so could, could you fight Worski in real life? Like, do you think you could take him? Yeah. Yes. He, he's Can a we arrange guy. this? Well, yeah, I don't mind. You want to fight him in IRL? <laughs> no, no. I don't want to because I don't need to. Okay. But I'll tell you this. Uh, he, he's internet tough. Okay. Look, the, the pine cone said it, you know, like when the, the whole dispute over the bedroom things happened that I wanted the private bedroom and, uh, and Andy, you know, threw a hissy fit. Well, the obvious answer, you know, is who wound up sleeping in the bedroom? It's as simple as that. I did. And that's the winner. That's how you tell the winner. OK, the guy is all bark. He's a little puppy uh, and he barks and yaps and yaps and yaps. And then he lies because he doesn't have anything else going for him. I never said anything. And, and you know, the, the fuck, you guys know me. If I had told some girlfriend to have an abortion, if she'd had an abortion, I'd say so. I don't give a shit. So, I mean, like, coach, you can blow me. Do as you far swear as on goes. Andy's sister's feet what you're saying is true? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I swear on Andy's sister's feet that, yeah, I never told them that I told a girlfriend to have an abortion. No, never. That's a lie. That's a so, what do you think about the new name they're going to run with? Coach Abortion Pill. Do you think it'll stick? That's a pretty cool name, actually. I like it. You know, it's better than Coach Red Pill. Well, Coach Red Pill is cringy as fuck, let's be honest. But uh, Coach Abortion Pill, yeah, I kind of like, just call me, uh, what, what's it called? RU86? R- RUD86? I forget the name of the, the number of the abortion pill. You know what I'm talking about? Why would you, why would you know that offhand? How many abortion pills are you dealing with on a daily basis? <laughs> How many abortion well, pills do you remember? Friends. Wait a minute. Like, well, well, it was before your time. It was like a big to-do back about 10 years ago about the, the abortion pill. And everybody was freaking out and saying, oh, it's an abortion pill. It's not and this and that, the other. It was like a whole deal. You don't recall? It was on the news like every night. Okay. I'm before your time. Okay. But, it's, yeah. it's okay, coach. I'm pretty sure everything in your life was before our time. You know, <laughs> yes. Like, you are like 300 fucking years old, you ancient prick. Well, what can I say? But listen, I just want to make it really, really clear. If I had said that, I would admit it. I've admitted to other shit. I don't have a problem with it. If I'd said that I'd convinced uh, some girlfriend to have an abortion, I would admit it. I never said that to any girlfriend, period. That's bullshit. Why would would they say that you told them that? Oh, because it's uh, probably the only lie they could come up with or something like that. It's just stupid. But why would it be your girlfriend? Why wouldn't it just be your wife or something? I don't know. I don't, I don't know, honestly. 
I don't know. It seems like there's corroborating evidence for this. Oh, what? Please, please do not I'd love bring... to see that corroborating evidence. Please do not bring Dick Masterson into us. He's a man of purity and grace. <laughs> oh, I, I, you want to bring like him in? Him. No, I don't. Don't. <laughs> please. We're going to besmirch Dick Masterson on the fucking PPP stream. Ooh. I don't know if he can handle it. Oof. I no, know. I like Dick. I have I have nothing but a high like heart for you. <laughs> you know? But but if you gotta if you gotta do what you gotta do, you gotta do what you gotta do. You know what I'm saying? But no, I never ever said anything of the sort because well, look, you're if either you're if either I had if I had I would admit it this. now. Like, look, coach, you're either telling the truth about this or lying about something else. Sure. Or you're Telling the truth. Well, how would I be lying about something else? Well, you haven't yet admitted to coming on those pictures of Melanie Walsh. No, because I never did. <laughs> no matter how much you insist, I never have. Yeah. I don't know. It it seems pretty convincing, the evidence that's been presented before the court that... <laughs> Yeah. Somebody, somebody, somebody has posted me a picture here of you smearing the word Pinochet on a picture of Melanie Worski's feet. <laughs> oh, now, my God. Show it. Show it. Show it on stream. Godwinson, are you bullshitting us? Is, there, is this real? No, I just made it up for public effect. <laughs> Fuck Godwinson. God damn it. You can't tell us you just but, received uh, it. You can make this happen. You can make my dreams be memes. <laughs> You're making my dreams come true. Woo -woo. Yeah. Oh, oh God, man, these guys—they they freak the fuck out. How many people are watching the stream? Two hundred. More people than watch yours, actually. I think it's three. Yeah, I, I know that's embarrassing. I don't How much did your birthday stream? Post? There are there are seventy. Uh, Can you believe this? That? Actually, is doing double the birthday stream. The birthday yeah. stream peaked at like one hundred and twenty viewers. No, oh, that's, that's not even, even coaching age yet, is it? One hundred and twenty. One hundred and seven. I don't know why my streams don't get uh, bigger numbers. Uh, you know, my my videos consistently, I get like uh, you know. Right off the bat, I get 15, 20,000 views, but the streams, no, -uh. I don't know why, but well, you know, shit, if those are my biggest problems in life, I got it lucky. You know what I'm saying? Half of the people subscribed to PPP are watching the stream. And if you're not subscribed, make sure you don't subscribe so we can't ever get super chats and ruin his streams with. with Can you imagine, guys, when we get to a thousand subscribers? What the fuck am I going to do? You're fucked. Don't enable super chats. Only only people, only experts like me can enable super chats <laughs> and handle that incredible responsibility. Yes, Josh. I know. Imagine if I got drunk and they, they started super chatting in, uh, I'd pretty much Ooh. be in a jail cell. By uh, <laughs> by the next day, I, I would probably read them uncensored. Be tough. What, to to like the the judge arraigning you <laughs> with your crimes. Someone here is reading. Yeah has written something, I'm not going to say the, uh, fact, fuck it, I'll just say it. Uh, someone has said that your streams don't put in stuff because without a script, you're a boring cunt coach. Probably. Do you agree with that? Probably, yeah. I, yeah. I don't know, I think, I think your IRL, uh, your actual videos are sort of a higher production value than your streams. That's the pure and simple of it, right? Yeah, mm. I mean, coaches' videos are incredible. Each one is its own <laughs> piece of pornography in and of itself. Every single video he's ever done you know, I've jerked off to at least twice. So you know what the stream that will get you the most viewers will be, Coach Reptil? Yes. If you streamed live, you ejaculating on pictures of Melanie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, it's what you do in your spare time anyway. So mm. just let the fans. I don't, I don't. Oh man, you can get even me into trouble, all kinds of trouble. This is just too funny. This, this retard, you know, like oh man, he's, he's just. You know, I, I used to think that he was smart, and uh, no, he, he's just sort of cunning. But bottom line, he's kind of like a moron. You know, mm -hmm. Andy Worski. You know, he's just ugh. You know, he just he just fucks up everything. He has no impulse control. Thank you, Coach. I've I've been saying that for a long time now, uh, and I agree. He needs to go to a correctional facility. <laughs> and, you know, they, they've been expressing themselves to their full capabilities, and now they must end up in correctional facilities. I I think it's it's poetry. Poetry. Yeah. Yeah, and the fact of the matter is, you know, these guys, they're acting like fucking, I mean, like Andy Worski did that, those two videos on JF. Now, everybody knows that I have a, a great deal of affection for JF because JF uh, stuck, his, st stuck his neck out for me when it could have potentially cost him quite a bit. And he gave me a platform to answer Sargon's smears. And he was, uh, he was very uh, hardcore and direct. And he was only after the truth. And he gave me a fair shake. And for that, I'll always be grateful to him, right? 
Uh, and so, you know, when Andy Worski did those two videos about JF, now I, I just mentioned my relationship and my appreciation for JF before I say this, you'll think it colors my appreciation, but those videos that Andy made were just kraut level hit pieces. And that's why I objected to them. I, I, I it's, it's not so much, I mean, everyone, I didn't object to them. What? They, uh, they featured me in PPP, high five brother. Oh, it's quite yeah, fine. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's quite but, a legitimate source. But the thing is, see, it was um, it was nasty what Andy had done, and he had started that whole fight. And this whole thing started with me telling Andy, man, why are you starting fights with everybody? You're starting fights with JF. You're starting fights with Jared Holt. You're going to sue him. Uh, you're starting fights with uh, other people. I forget who. And I, I said to him to his face, what, are you going to wind up starting a fight with me? Lo and behold, that's what he did. He got this is like Shakespeare. Yeah, that's why it's like Shakespeare. It's like a Shakespearean tragedy for five five consecutive days. And Andy thought that there'd be no consequences. Of course, there are going to be consequences, Andy Worski. Yeah. Our and consequence is now, never going to be the same. You now, done goof. Little puppy. Uh, uh, how are things going for you now, huh? Yap all you want on Twitter like a little fucking bitch. But, uh, you know, where are you now? Spreading lies and hanging on by your fingernails on YouTube. I mean, let's face facts. Andy Worski's career on YouTube is done. I mean, he's got like a quarter of a million subs, right? He's lost over 10% from his peak, right? He keeps on bleeding subs. He only had a, a little reprieve from that bleeding during the Knoxville days, right? But it's been bleeding subs every day. And his views, they're paltry. They're pathetic. I mean, like, uh, look, I'll call him up right now. Let me just uh, look at them. You can go on Social Blade. Andy Worski. The burial. The Social Blade burial promo. Coach, hey, Look it. at this. You see, look at you this. Monday, 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 Monday. Hang, on Hang on a second here. On Sunday, right, the full day, for the whole day, he got 3,797 views, 3,800 views. The day before that, 3,600 views. The day before that, 4,100 views. We're talking about somebody who has over a quarter of a million subscribers, and he's getting barely, barely, not quite 2% daily views. That, that's the, the state of his channel. And he was on stream me thinking he was going to make some buck doing these, uh, make some bucks, you know, doing these 10 hour streams so that he'd get on the leaderboard. And how did that play out for you, Andy? Huh? Yeah, you fucking lost, you retard. Yeah, your channel is dying, if not dead, you know, and you're, 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 you're trying to get the shekels on stream me while well, that blew up in your face because there's no more fucking stream me. Yeah, Andy, you're a fucking loser. You never paid attention to what you were supposed to pay attention, which is making fucking content, you stupid retard. Jeez. Give us the coach Christ. laugh. Give no, us the coach laugh. Come on. About this. No, coach, you need to you need to lower your blood pressure. You need to relax. You need to whip out those pictures of Melanie Worski and just <laughs> <laughs> Oh guys, I like think I, that's I gonna raise his heart rate. Like, Oh, Andy is yeah. not finished because all he has to do is just get his sister to show pictures of her feet like on stream and everybody will be hyped. They'll come back and watch the show. But that's what he has to do. He either has to spread his asshole or get his sister to do it. I don't know. Oh, he tweeted out just now, uh, don't you love when an old perverted sack of garbage like Coach Red Bull talks about your younger sister in a disgusting way? Sorry, Coach, my sister doesn't go for dirty old men like yourself. Some people are in class. <laughs> I did it! I did it, you bastards! Oh. We did it! We did oh, it, Red! We did it! We did it! We did it. You are. Disavow your disgusting actions, Coach. <laughs> you bastard! Everybody in the stream is turned on you, Coach. Oh, well, for shame, you bastards! You backstabbed me with your gay ops. Oh, oh, oh! I couldn't have planned it any better. This is <laughs> envisioned. This, you know, I, I'm like Conor McGregor. I, I see that these things, and I visualize it. It comes true, you know. Three yeah. months ago, I was sitting on the streets homeless. I visualized this moment. Now it's come true. It's true. Oh, man. You guys are awful. <laughs> oh, so, man. How is Andy Worski? You can only be haunted by this for the rest of your <laughs> Yeah, the, the, feet, the feet jokes is all good fun. We've had a good laugh. But really, how old, how old is she? How old? Really? How old? Get to the quick. There's yeah. a reason I want to know. Does anybody know their actual age? Chat? You the actual age of who? Coach, what the actual age of whom? Of uh, of Andy Worski's sister. She might be too old for you. <laughs> How old? Is she? Oh, I don't know. Because I don't know. Worski, Worski is thirty or thirty-one. Is she older than him or younger than him? To be, to be so honest, people, 
expect you would know most because you've said that the picture's long enough. <laughs> no, no, serious. I, I have no idea. Does anybody know? I no. believe that she is actually 16 years old. No, nah, no, no, she's not. She's older than him, I'm pretty sure. She's older than Really? Me. I think so. Damn, she's a foxy lady for her age. Holy shit. Yeah. I hear she's 51, Coach, so that makes you <laughs> years, right? No, but that, that would be because, you see, um, well, if, if she is older than Andy Worski, well, my wife is younger than Andy Worski. So I guess my wife is younger than, uh, than what you call it, than uh, Andy's sister, assuming she's okay. older than him. Yeah. You heard it here first, folks. Coach only ejaculates wow. on young flesh. Yes, exactly right. <laughs> I don't know where we can go from here, guys. I, have we buried Worski enough, or do we want to keep fucking burying Worski in his grave? It's your stream, and yeah, we can do whatever you want. <laughs> what do you? I'm enjoying it, but I just I think of Ju I think of Jush, and he, I I, oh, I Josh, think he had I to go know, half uh, an hour ago. He's yeah, already Josh. in bed. He's he's, he's before you were uh, this in bed. I'm, I'm, I'm like a zombie drilling on myself right now. <laughs> Josh, send your King of Pole DM, please. I want to see what he's been doing, begging for our. Oh, no, everything that he sent me is public in the um, in the the takedown board on the Kiwi Farms. They made all that public. Did you send him outlines? No. Did you smear KOP on your balls and send it? No. In a, in a How the fuck mode? could you even smear King of Pole? King of Pole is a smear on himself. Hey, no, He's a smear on no, humanity. No, no. He's talking about how somebody wrote King of Pole on their balls and sent him a picture of, of, of their balls with King of Pole. Right. That was bizarre. What? That's was a that real fun? thing that happened? Yes. Yeah, some some friend of his. It's just oh my fucking God. weird. <laughs> Even PPP is like, I can't believe somebody would do that. <laughs> I, I, I'm trying to think what friends of mine could I get to write PPP on their walls? And I don't I, know if any of them would do it. I don't. No, I, I know none who would do it. Somebody, oh, it's, it's, it, it, was it was Joaquin. Later on, about the events of tonight or uh, the morning, wherever he is at the moment. Um, will you be watching? What? I missed it. You dropped out. Yeah, so Worski's going to be streaming about the events of Oh, I could do it, Liz. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> in a few hours, or maybe even soon. So will you be watching, Coach? Will no. you be trying to get on that stream? Well, if, he, <laughs> if he streams in a couple hours from now, it's going to be in the middle of the night. Like, yeah. If it's he a, wants Coach to watch at, it live, he needs to do it in the morning. Midnight here, yeah. And, like, uh, I'm running on fumes at this point, but no uh, way. Uh, yeah. uh, I mean, guys, I'm into my fourth uh, energy drink already today. It's, it's like fucking 5 p.m. where you're at. <laughs> Yeah, well, how do you think PPP maintains this energy level? You don't think it's natural, do you? How do you think PPP stays this high energy on this Tucker Carlson-like level of high energy? I, I thought it was pills. I didn't know it was just energy drinks. What do you name Keemstar? What the fuck? No, I don't know. I, I remember, Coach, we, we take Adderall as well, prescribed from a very good physician, and uh, it really gets you going. Once you get on the Adderall energy drink combo, yeah. life is just yeah. so good. Do you guys realize the funny thing that's going to be happening in that house of hell in Richmond, right? These two retards are going to be like spurging out about me, okay, all of today and probably all of tomorrow, instead of paying attention to the important thing of today, which is they have been blown the fuck off of their only platform. Uh, where are they going to go now? Huh? Where, where are it's they going to What? Well, that's what I was it's thinking. Over. Like I, I wanted to, I wanted to watch the uh, the stream today, and I was planning on going to bed a couple hours ago to watch. I was like, should I even bother to to wake up in three hours from now and check and see if if they've got something together? Because like I, I, we had Palmer Eldrick or whatever in the chat, and he didn't seem to indicate that it would be on his channel. So well, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to search far and wide to find this obscure fucking stream. Even people who are shit talking them can't even find the energy to hate watch their shit. <laughs> Who's going to search this down to the ends of the earth to find the new platform? You. Their audience won't crack you. a thousand again. You, know, you you're young, PPP. You, you're a young man. You can do this. You're Canadian. You have to. What the fuck oh. is being Canadian? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. This is what Canadians do. Canadians you sacrifice know, um, themselves for the greater good. Canadians yeah. are like fucking bloodhounds. They can sniff out obscure internet streams. <laughs> well, PPP <laughs> is Worski's fellow countryman, right? You you could probably browse an empty flat now if you were <laughs> active enough. Look, I what I want is for somebody to give me Worski's address in Canada. If somebody out there can please, please give it to me. I would love to knock his door and try and sell him a water filter. Please let me do that. 
<laughs> yeah. I'm just going to knock oh, his door. Did you, door that? Did you film that, please? Please. I will. Yeah, if, if I ever get his address, I will drive the few hours to Mississauga. I will knock his door in my home water jacket and give him the home water pitch and see if he lets me into his basement to sell him the filter to check his main line. Oh, people are telling yeah. me that uh, Killstream is now going to be on Worski's channel. Oh, oh God. that's not gonna last long. Yeah, that, I mean, yeah, that's that's don't Andy. If you're listening to this, don't do that. It's a checkmate move. Don't listen to Josh. Don't listen to Josh. <laughs> <laughs> don't listen to Josh. Don't uh, listen to Josh. Andy, do it. Do it, Andy. Do it, Andy. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Do it. Do it, Andy. You won't do it. Do it. Do yeah, it, Andy. You'll be fine. Nothing will happen. Yeah, you'll be fine. Yeah. Trust me. What are those faggots? No, nothing. Yeah. For the owner of Jimmy yeah. Farms, Josh sure does troll shield a lot, you know? Oh, He's probably the nicest guy that's on the not, internet I've ever met. That's not what troll shielding is. I mean, you're just trying to help somebody. Troll shielding is when you troll somebody to protect yourself from being trolled. Like, let's say if you release some kind of audio tapes where you confess to watching a six-year-old girl getting raped in the ass, and then you run around calling everybody else pedophiles. That's troll shielding. Just saying, hey, that's a bad idea. That's not I love how much energy came into Josh's voice yeah. as soon as the word troll shielding occurred. Did you notice his energy? I, level one I, like 20 octaves that I, was awesome I am a, a firm believer in keeping true to the lore and making sure we get our language right. <laughs> I know. Don't you are like that. the Keck Fesser, you know? That's the Keck Fesser Josh who keeps us all straight. Keeps us all straight. Thank you. I, I appreciate this honorary title. Uh, the, the PPP kingdom has bestowed upon me. The, the title. The landed the title. P- okay, if there so- is such a thing as the PPP kingdom, I think it's in ruins. I think it's fucking... <laughs> is there a big gaping hole in the back where the mongols have invaded yeah it's it's shambolic it's in a fucking shambles as godwinson would say I know. <laughs> uh, oh man so, so i don't know is ppp coin going through the roof once we hit a thousand subs i don't know what to do i, I didn't ever thought that would happen on ppp coin you know if ppp oh, coin goes, man, i feel betrayed what about coach coin you bastards no i shorted coach coin a long time ago Ooh, oh that work out for you huh well, PPP coin is rising through the roof at the moment, so. Yeah, but Coach Coin is all stream watches compared to the 10 that the birthday stream got. The birthday stream didn't do well. It didn't fly so good. But, uh, you know, PPP is what you would consider blood sports reckoning. You know, that's, 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 that was the worst bane ever. But I am I'm blood sports reckoning. That's the end. Today oh, is Ragnarok. Oh, the word is the word here on the board is that uh, there, he's not giving him his main channel, but giving him his uh, Purple Dragon channel. Oh, what 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 board is this, Coach? Are you reading Eight Chan again? Yeah. Oh no. A- Eight Chan Cyclical is Coach's homepage. <laughs> he opens his <laughs> browser. It just goes right to the last red post. Oh wow. Coach, have you ever considered maybe not reading the Chan boards? Have oh, yeah. What considered that, that maybe you're a little too old? Yeah, what happens is that I sort of like go through these phases, right? That I like just like feed on it like every day, right? And then I sort of like forget about it. And then weeks go well, by. Coach, you do realize that it's it's you, Worski, Ralph, yeah. and a few other e-celebs all yeah. posting. <laughs> it's 20 e like and five five anons. Yeah, I know. That's why it's so well, funny. Like, you might as well just read Twitter. What? So you might as well just read Twitch if you want to know what all the Twitter isn't is. as much fun. Coach, Coach believes that the board set the uh, the pace for everything else. Those hey, are the uh, you legit the taste believe make. The code. You're not going to get pictures of Melanie's feet covered in cum on Twitter. You're just not. You're not going to get that kind of content there. You yeah, I mean, that's, why, that's why Coach Do we get that on Kiwi, way? though? Josh, do we get that on Kiwi, or is that banned? It wouldn't be banned. Nobody's bothered, though. Do you do Coach's containment board for his Melanie Worski cum tributes? You can post it right in Andy's thread. I don't give a shit. Go ahead, Coach. What? <laughs> coach, please. I, I, I coach, out. either you have to stop browsing the boards or you have to do a come tribute to melanie that's it <laughs> okay then i'll stop uh, browsing the boards how's that you fucking pussy like are you addicted to what cow says about you no 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 i i'm just a, I, I love the memes and i just love the flow of it you know uh and i recognize that most of the time the the posters are the isa lives and they're just flinging shit at one another and I find it funny. You're full of shit. Nobody enjoys using an image board. <laughs> I'm calling bullshit. Okay. I don't know. I, I really, I enjoy it. I am addicted to when people talk about me on the boards. And <laughs> coach, I, coach, we talk about you coach, incessantly. Coach, 
much. How long? Yeah. Do you spend? I get a huge boner every time the the letters P, P, and P appear in sequential mm. order. Yeah, right. I get a big boner. Coach, how long do you spend working out the image capture? About ten minutes. What? All right. Okay. okay. I suppose you always have a permanent ID, so you never need to uh, renew it. <laughs> oh God. Oh God. <sighs> this is uh, this is a very interesting stream. I think we've we've learned a lot about our friend Coach. <laughs> what what have you learned well, well i mean we, all i know is that um everyone's tweeting out that you should stop masturbating over pictures of melanie Walker. <laughs> <laughs> oh man you made that real you guys have totally so gay off me on that one damn man I, I i just you know i had a dream and it came true it wasn't quite as uh, tremendous as Martin Luther King's dream, but I, I believe that it was pretty glorious, folks. I, we've achieved it. We've achieved it. Well, the funny thing about all this, okay, is that, see, Andy's going to do like uh, like videos about me, right? And he's going to do a stream about me and just shit on me for God knows how long. See, but he doesn't seem to realize that his audience and, and the bulk of my audience do not overlap. And so it's it's not going to hurt me and it will hurt him because people are gonna get bored with his obsessiveness. And a lot of the stuff that he's gonna be saying about me is just obviously absurd. And so everybody's gonna be like, what the fuck, man, move on. So will there be a twisted mind of CRP video oh, series? Absolutely, uh, I'll lay money on it. And it's, it's gonna take him an enormous amount of time and effort to do these videos against me. And it's not gonna help him. And it's certainly not gonna hurt me. So it's just going to be like, he's just going to be throwing away his time and effort, you know? Well, I can guarantee, personally, I'm coming out with the twisted mind of CRP. Oh, gonna... oh boy. Yeah. I'm going to say this, and then I need to sleep because I'm about to pass out. Um, in the off chance oh, that, that Jimothy Mediocre is watching this stream, I've, I've, I've responded in kind to uh, him not doing morning streams anymore. <clears throat> You should stream on VK.com. It is the Russian equivalent of Facebook. I guarantee you they will not give a shit, and their streaming quality is as good as any enterprise service. Uh, just, a, just a thought. <clears throat> what, that that uh, the gunster is going to start streaming on VK? Well, I'm suggesting that uh, Jim stream on VK. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm suggesting that Jim ride off into the sunset. That's what I suggest. <laughs> are you are you suggesting he literally ride off into the sunset or, or like kill himself? Is that a euphemism? No, no. I'm just saying he should just stop going on the internet as Jim. And at least for like five years, he's going to have to let it die down because uh, it's over. The era of the internet that Jim's from and Josh is from and even I'm from is fucking dead. And oh yeah, the internet's, the internet's dying. It's like it's like yeah. a it's like a great old tree that's been poisoned and it's just it's, it takes a while. It's going to take a couple of years for the branches to finally rot and fall off, but we're getting there. Yeah, it's sad. When even Jim's fan, like if if you're a Jim fan and you pay pig, you're not a real Jim fan. I don't know. It just it doesn't make sense. You've gone against Jim's own principles, his own stated principles. All right, is that the end for Josh? Is that the end for this stream? Oh, hang on. I've I've been sent some interesting DMs. Just a moment. Ooh. Uh, okay. <clears throat> All right, but I'll I'll see you guys in, when I see you. Okay, Josh. Uh, we're gonna miss it. It's not gonna be the same. It's the four horsemen are breaking up. The <laughs> horsemen break up. It's like the Beatles, man. The the. Yeah, uh, the Horseman of Famine will return one day. I assure you. Hello, Josh you is the Horseman of Famine. Everybody claim your horse <laughs> <laughs> before it's too late, before you get stuck with a shitty one. Hello, Josh. You asked me to write a one-time ban appeal, and at the time, I took the wrong approach and decided to try and talk you on Discord, <laughs> rather than efficiently and coherently taking my time to respond to you through the proper channels. I would like to rectify that and properly appeal. So you've you've unbanned him now, haven't you, Josh? I, I've unbanned him as of like six hours ago. Well, you can thank Godwinson for that, Brian, but I don't want uh, you to beg me for my outlines, I'm afraid. <clears throat> First, an apology and promise to you officially, and then it's some autism about him believing that Kiwi Farms is a place of shit hosting, non-serious fun, and I should be able to dox Coach Red Pill as much as I want. Um, he loves Kiwi Farms. He names members like Cricket, Flossman, Dawn Dusk. Um, God, this is very autistic, isn't it? Why did you ban him? Because he's a weirdo and he makes me genuinely uncomfortable with his endless appreciation of me. He just wants you, he just wants your outlines. <laughs> your dick pics. My my outlines are, are state secret. I can't. It's, it's not it's not allowed. People are telling me to do a video on Blaze Movie Fan. I already have. I think I did it in like what, 2014. Should be out there somewhere. Godwinson, you were around in 2014. 
Yeah, yeah. I mean, I started in like 2012, 2013. Oh, wow. So you've been wasting your life with this a long time. Yes. When do you think you're going to stop, Godwinson? Do you think this is a I think problem? I'm gonna be, I, think, I think I was talking about this the other day. I think I'll be coach's agent doing the same thing. <laughs> I want to. I want to suicide before that happens. I'm afraid. I, I look at coaches here, distorted mirror of myself, and I don't want to be that. <laughs> one, day, <laughs> one day, I feel like a distorted reflection now. of what coach would be if he was alive in this era. That's what I feel like most days. Yeah, PPP has this theory that if you were, <clears throat> if you were growing up now, coach, <laughs> and you were 23 now mm-hmm. in in the current year. You'd be spreading cheeks on cam? No, no, no. <laughs> Coach, you can't imagine an avenue in your life where you would spread your ass and reveal a beautiful pink starfish to the world. No, when I was 23, I was, I, I was finishing. I was getting ready to go to college. Uh, I, I was. I just just finished a stint of like four years working as an English teacher. English as a second language, and I had my head pretty screwed, pretty well screwed on straight. And uh, yeah. And things were so looking you're up. saying my head's not screwed on quite straight, Coach. Well, no, 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 I'm not saying that. I was saying that when I was 23, I had my shit pretty organized. I would not have been online at that time. Well, uh, just because I fucked Ralph's mother and Andy's sister <laughs> does not mean my head is not screwed on straight. I object to that. Okay. okay. Yeah, the implication was wrong on my part, and I do apologize. God bless you, Co- Coach. Apologize to me, guys. He cocked. He, he cocked, guys. Yeah, like like the hidden stream that you and I had, the birthday screen, stream. You know. Yeah. yeah. You, you totally own my ass, and that's the truth. Yeah. You know, I'm. Coach's really power ashamed. level is low. Coach's yeah, power I'm level is very low, guys. Yep. Okay, guys. People, I'm tired of sad, coach. Coach, yeah. cheer up, coach. Oh, okay, it's it's late as hell in here. It's almost one o'clock. So yeah. I'll, you're gonna have a lot to wake up to, coach, from the sounds of it. <laughs> oh, oh, who cares? Yeah, I'm not gonna be paying attention to these guys. Yeah. So anyway, three P, Godwinson, Josh, as always, chat. Thank you very much. Take it easy, guys. All right, bye, bye. Bye. Okay, it's the end of coach. I blew him the fuck out. Left and now it's just, just two. It's the classic duo. It's the dynamic duo. How do you think all that went? I think I was uh, successful in pushing Coach as the fellow that... I, I really that. can't believe that we just destroyed Coach like that, Godwinson. We broke him. We broke him over the course of like five hours. We hey, got bro. Coach to confess Look. to his crimes. He'll recover. He's about to work out all of that energy now by coming on pictures of Melanie Worski. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's Ukrainian at like 1 a.m. there, isn't it? So, you know, he's got a lot to get out of his system. Holy shit. I don't know. I, I, I hope after this stream, he does go back to his ways of crime and just bust a huge load on a picture and post it to Cal. I hope that that's what happens. Well, I mean, it, it seems that he's going to start smearing the words Pinochet in his own cum pretty soon. So... I don't know. It, without the I others, see, I want to see the coach masterpiece where he blows up a, a sort of uh, a, a mural or mural wall-sized picture of Melanie Worski's feet, um, and he smears the words. Which words? The fourteen words. Godwinson. Danger, Godwinson. Danger, danger. I guess Godwinson left. I can't hear him. It's dead air. Godwinson's done. Oh my God! What the fuck do I do now, chat? When the words are so powerful, Godwinson dies. Um, Chat, should we end this stream? At what point did it start getting gay? At what point did we start to fail? Were people here the whole time were entertained? Coach. Hello, Godwinson. We heard the word coach. And then you just burn the flag, PPP, and then it all makes sense. Oh, I see. If I burn the flag, then it all makes sense. See, this is a psyop from Godwinson to defeat every other person in the blood sports game and and steal the blood throne for himself. PPP, you won't lose any um, legal standing if you burn the Confederate flag, will you? I'm probably going to end up having to burn the Confederate flag. Can you burn the Confederate flag now and make this this, uh, debut stream on your channel truly amazing? Make sure you've got Chat. like uh, make make sure you've got like a cup of water or something to hand. Yeah, see, this is the problem: is I don't want to fucking die in a fiery inferno live on air. As much as everyone wants to see that, um, press one if you want me to burn the Confederate flag. Press two if right. you just want us to end the stream. It's time for me to spam one. Godwinson, you fucking piece of shit. People are putting in one. I've been banned from sending too many messages. You fucker! Oh no. See Why the, do people want to see the Confederate flag be burned? Some people they want to see a flag, flag be burned. PPP. It's hard to get Confederate flags, though. Like it's there's a guy apparently that, uh, down your road that sells them, right? Called Bill. Yeah, but that guy lives like five hours away from here, and he may already be in jail or dead. Fuck. 
Coach says to burn the Israeli flag equals two. Fuck you, coach, you piece of shit. I knew he didn't really go to bed. He's just wanting to fucking get us back for uh, for maligning him and exposing the truth. Well, look, he needs to work up enough calm to smear Wilshire Boulevard on a mural-sized picture of Mer- Melody Worski, so... <sighs> I don't know. One day, one day we are going to fucking have to burn the flag. Uh, no, today you burn the flag, PPP. Come on. Come on now. Burn a flag. <sighs> Fuck. D- do I burn the weed flag? That's not really iconic to the show. Just burn a flag and, and we'll see how it goes. Godwinson, you're really almost convinced me. When I well, hear I mean, that British voice, it'll be I memorable. can't help but think it's a big brained move. It'll be iconic. <sighs> Fuck. I'm trapped. There there's, there's no way out. So you've got to show your camera, PPP. There, there is no way out, guys. Where's the lighter? We gotta find a lighter. Where is it? So switch your camera on first of all. <sighs> Godwinson, I'm, I'm in the dark and I'm naked though, Godwinson. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We've all seen. We've all seen ass. We've all seen the yeah. starfish. Yeah. God, Godwinson, you really are a master of of breaking my will. You're breaking me down. I'm, I'm, fuck. I'm gonna get banned for burning the flag. Just, um. Show your screen. Don't let me do it, Godwinson. Don't stop the peer pressure. I can't say no to you with that sexy British accent. Fuck. Put on, put on some clothes and, and show your screen. <sighs> Fuck. All right. It's happening. Here we go, lads. Here we go. Where, where's my camera? Release released than when Coach comes on pictures of Melody Worski. I don't know. If, if Coach... Okay, here's the deal. If Coach really does release a cum tribute, I will burn the Israeli flag live on air. If he does it for real. Well, we just want... We want a we want a flag to be burned. <sighs> Fuck. You really are in the Fine. Dark, you fuckers. Fine. You need to switch on a light or light a candle Fuck. or something. All right. He's, he's going to burn a flag in the darkness. This, this either might be incredibly keno or... Look at that! Look at that Israeli flag. There's, there's better be lighting there. now, folks. There's better lighting. Yep, yep. It's uh, Kino effect. So, which flag will you be burning? My guns is popping out, folks. The guns is popping out. Um, he just Godwinson. Hello. Are you still there, Godwinson? I am. Yes. Uh, hello. Hello. Hello, PPP. Hello. Okay, it's still going. All right. Um, so move back a few paces. I don't know. Should we burn this one instead, guys? Yeah, yeah. Bur- burn that one, PPP. That, that flag there, the one that supports marijuana? Can you burn it outside, maybe? Or are you going to burn it in the flat? I can't decide, like, is this is this safe? Um, get, a, get, a, get a glass of water to hand. Or better yet, God, get so a glass... I don't know if that's of... really going to work out. Fill up a glass of vodka or something and use that to douse the flames. Oh, use the fucking vodka to get to douse the flames. That's a big brain move. Some people are saying not to burn the weed flag. Do we burn the Trump flag? That's probably the safest way to go, isn't it? Oh, there's a Trump flag. Yeah, burn that. Burn that, PPP, with your shirt off. Burn that with my shirt off. That's what chat wants. That's And chat is the master of my fate and the captain of my soul, right? I can't say no to chat. Fuck. Do you have a bathroom? Josh, Josh is back! PPP. Josh is returned! PPP, do you have a bathroom? Well, yeah, I fucking have a bathroom. Do you have, like, a bath basin? Yeah, I do, yeah. So so go to there and run the water and, and hang the flag over it while you burn it so you don't destroy your house. Fuck. Have you got the lighter? I'm gonna have to do it, aren't I? Can, can you light the lighter to show chat you're not bullshitting? We have we have the lighter. It's uh, it's right here. It's in, It's in my hand. The flame of light. Should we just burn the whole flat down? Is that what we should do? Should I just end it all here live on stream and just light the couch on fire? I think I think maybe drop the lighter, PPP. Drop the lighter, still lit. It's not a fucking Zippo, Godwinson. It's not a Zippo, right? So it's not... Coach is fucking back. No, he's not. No, he's not. I thought he was back. I was looking at my TV screen, which was like half an hour behind. The peer oh, pressure is cool. getting to me. Burn the flag. Burn the Trump flag. You know you want to. I just, I don't know if I can do that, Godwin. The Trump supporters are the Donald. Do you know what they'll do to me, Godwinson? Well, you're the mascot for are the Donald. So. Am I? I am now the mascot, the official mascot for are the Donald. No, I'm just going to get naked. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm getting naked. Fuck it. Oh, he really Fuck is. It. Oh, my goodness. Fuck it. He's <laughs> <Just naked. laughs> guys. He's fired up for me to remove the underwear, guys. Is everybody fired up for this? <laughs> oh, yeah! Everybody, yeah. please mirror this. Do not let this iconic moment of the internet die. 
Yeah, baby. Yeah, the public exhibitionism's firing me up. Yeah. Woo. Always oh, remember right. they did this because Coach Red Pill ejaculated on pictures of Melanie Worski. Yeah. The only reason I'm doing this is because Coach Red Pill ejaculated on pictures of Melanie Worski. Dog. Dogs. Dogs. He's turned on. He's turned on by this. I don't know. Some of them are. Some of them are fucking fucked. I don't know. Can you at least Should I say Mike off, off you Kip voters? Can you burn your uh, nipples? Uh, can I blur my nipples? Burn your nipple. Or have I? Burn it. <sighs> you fuckers. Is it time? It's time, PPP. I'm going to do it. I already did it, actually, on fucking live stream before. It's not really a big deal. I have to say, PPP, you're the best co-host I could ever have wished for. You blow all well, the rest fuck, of them out of the man. water. I don't know. I, I feel as though this is an iconic stream. Uh, I don't know how else to go from here other than to just light this flag on fire. Fuck it. Let's end this. Oh, what the fuck? Off the wall. Boys, the lighter fucking died. Oh, oh, it's back. Take it off the wall, PPP, first of all. You can't just light it on the wall. That will cause your... Fuck, boys. Fuck. Somebody in PPP's uh, living situation is looking at him. Is this correct? They can't make your behavior. <laughs> yeah. What's room going room on? There's a, there's a Patreon. Huh? <laughs> you, what's you're what's right, going right? on, folks? They're questioning you, right? I don't know. I don't know, guys. <laughs> I don't know. Are they telling you not to burn down the flat? Are they telling you not to they're burn down the flat? Yeah, what the fuck? Oh, oh they called the police. I think, uh, yeah. They I think the they lost. Uh, they lost their minds a little bit. It's tough. <laughs> PPP, put your clothes back on and get ready to meet the fire brigade, please. I don't want you to greet the fire brigade in Canada like this. Look, the night, okay, the night I spread my asshole, the police got called. And when they came in, I was dressed just like this. And I explained the situation to them in just my, uh, in just my boxer shorts. It was, uh, it was impressive. I'm just trying to spread body positivity, Godwinson. So, so will you or will you not be burning the flag? I can't do it. I can't burn it. This Is flag here are, means a lot to me. Well, there are people in your living situation out there that are telling you not to set fire to the flat. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. We'll probably do a video where I eventually burn the flag, but the longer we build up me burning the flag, the more hype there is for when I eventually do burn the flag, you see. This is business sense. I'll do it once I get to a thousand subs and I can get the super berries for it. That's a big brained move, isn't it? All right, PPP. I'm, uh, I'm You're done, done Godwin. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I say we'll do the same thing next week, um, this week and next year. Um, yeah. As I say. Yeah. Hopefully I can keep my clothes on uh, for the next stream. <laughs> that would be That would be a positive. <sighs> Uh, I'll leave you with the chat, my friend. Just, um, all right, that's it, Godwinson. I think we might go for another minute or two. All right. Which is me and the chat, and they might convince me to burn the flag, and you'll miss it. All right. Well, it, well, if so happens, I'll, I'll watch the endless mirrors. All right, my friend. There won't be any mirrors. Our audience doesn't know how to mirror. They're retarded. They don't know how to nail people to the cross. They don't go on Kiwi Farms. All right, that's it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, it is uh, it's over. Uh, the the fucking shit on Worski stream has ended, and uh, we're gonna end it by uh, by lighting my nipple if we can, and that's gonna be the end of the goddamn fucking stream. Just do a fucking smiley on my nipple again, and yeah, uh, it fucking does hurt to do the smiley on your nipple. It's the end of the stream. Go home, all of you. You fucking suck. Yep, you all fucking suck. I'm tired of the chat. Tired of blood sports, and uh, I hope I hope that Andy and Ralph enjoy living together. Meme magic is real. Meme magic is real, guys.